ഓം വക്രതുണ്ട മഹാകായ സൂര്യകോടി സമപ്രഭ നിർവിഘ്നം കുറുമേ ദേവ സർവകാരേഷു സർവദാ സദാ ശിവ സമാരംഭാം ശങ്കരാചാര്യ മധ്യമാം അസ്മദാചാര്യപര്യന്ത മന്ദേ ഗുരുപരമ്പരാം സമസ്തജനകല്യാണേ നിരതം കരുണാമയം നമാമി ചിന്മയം ദേവം സദ്ഗുരും ബ്രഹ്മവിദ്വരം ഹരിയോം യെസ് ഹരിയോ സു ഭഗവാൻ നമനമഗ്രീഷിസ് ഉപദേശസാരം സുബനൈ ഗോത്ര ദിവസം ഉപദേശസാരമായി തർദ്ദണ്ട് വി ക്യാൻ കംപ്ലീറ്റ് ദ ടെക്സ് ഇൻ ഫൈവ് ഡേസ് ബിഫോർ ടേക്ക് അപ്പ് ദിസ് ബുക്ക് സോ ഐ സ്റ്റാർട്ട് ദ റീഡിംഗ് ഇറ്റ് വി റീഡ് ഇറ്റ് വി റീഡ് ദിസ് ബുക്ക് ഇന്ന് വി സ്റ്റഡി ദിസ് ബുക്ക് വെൻ വി വേർ ഇൻ സാന്ദിപ്പനി തമിഴ് ടെക്സ്റ്റ് ഉപദേശം ഉന്തിയാർ ദ ഒറിജിനൽ ആസ് ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് വി ഡിഡ് ഉപദേശം സാറും ട്രാൻസ്ലേഷൻ ഓഫ് ഉപദേശം ഉന്തിയാർ So I thought that I can complete this text in uh, five days, but that is not possible. It may take two, three years. What? Yes. <laughs> the rich thoughts are collected and kept in this uh, 30 slokas. Okay. So originally this is called Upadesa Undiya. <laughs> Original. So yes, Bhagavan uh, Ramana Magrishi composed this. So he composed originally in tamil upadesa undiya tamil people should feel proud oi upadesa undiya then afterwards he made it in sanskrit bhagwan ramana magrish is great scholar in tamil and sanskrit both the language so we are going to do this upadesa both the same thing only in upadesa undiya this is atma in upadesa undiya this is brahman it's not like the same atma only <laughs> okay same subject the languages in tamil language is sanskrit same subject two different languages upadesa sar or upadesa undiya the text starts like that so that is the vanam the forest is called daruka vanam in daruka vanam the rishis used to sit and they do this um karmas karma kandis they are more interested only in karma they do karma they want to attain many fruits including heaven so when they were doing like this completely involved in karma only not interested in knowledge completely neglecting the path of knowledge and moksha they are doing like lord shiva bhagwan lord shiva so he is very compassionate and he wanted to help this rishis so he came in the form of bikshadana murti a brahmachari murti and he came and he had some conversation with them and started teaching the jnana marga so this portion of a puranic uh, story read by one of the devotees of ramana magrishi that devo- devotee name is called muruganar so he read this uh, puranic story and he wanted ramana magrishi to compose the essence of the teaching of lord shiva in tamil he requested the murugana requested ramana magrishi to write the essence of uh, the message of lord shiva from the purana from the puranic story from the purana story so ramana magrishi took up this uh, uh, incident and he composed that composition is called upadesa undiyar so after some time he translated this into sanskrit this is the background okay when they were doing karma so what what is your problem let them do karma let them let them go to heaven so what is your problem why are you disturbing them okay so when you, when you ask this question karma is not the goal karma is a path indicated in bhagavad gita and all over vedantic text to attain the knowledge karma is karma should be used as a tool it is not the goal so that that point is established here by lord shiva 
and he gave this knowledge to this rishis. The same kind of uh, the parallel story you can see in the uh, Srimad Bhagavatam. When Lord Krishna and Balarama, they were there in Vrindavan. So one time this uh, Gopalas, they wanted to have some food. They did not or that bring on that particular day. So Lord Krishna asked, you go and you do, you ask from the rishis, those who are very busy <laughs> with the rituals there. And they went and they asked. The rishis neglected this uh, Gopalas. It's there in the 10th kind of Bhagavad. So they came back, all the Gopalas came back and they told. So we went and asked the rishis, they were very busy with the karma <laughs> rituals. They neglected us, what to do? Then afterwards, Lord Krishna took the stand of uh, um, what do you call it? The Loka, Loka Vivahara, the universal psychology. Okay, these people, they don't understand your value. You go and ask Yajna Patnis, mothers of the house, they, you go and ask. So they went and they asked, so Bhiksha, we need to have some food. Lord Krishna is there in the forest. Immediately they brought all the food. Chaturvida Mannam. They took all the food and went to Vrindavan. And they had the darshan of Lord Krishna. And Lord Krishna taught them Brahma Vidya, all the messages, whatever the Jiva wants. Then afterwards only the Rishis, they understood. And they went behind their uh, Patnis. Because of their Patnis, they got Brahma Vidya from Lord Krishna. Same uh, the story you can see in the 10th canto. This is somewhere in the Purana story. And Muruganar studied, he wanted Bhagavan Ramana Magarishi to compose. I am I'm not the right person to compose. You are the realized soul, the great teacher, great saint. You are the right person, please you compose. Bhagavan Ramana Magarishi composed it. Now see, the same part, the portion we can see in Bhagavad Gita also. First chapter, Arjuna Vishada Yogam, Arjuna fell down. How he has fallen, very nicely explained. How to fall also is with nice art. Simply you should not fall. How to fall? Other art. Arjuna fell down very nice. Arjuna Vishada Yoga. So Arjuna fell down. Krishna started Sankhya Yoga. In Sankhya Yoga, he brought so many logics. Point by point he brought all the things. Oh, the beginning, Lord Krishna was telling. <coughs> this is from Bhagavad Gita second chapter. This also is needed for this uh, Upadesara. Krishna says to Arjuna, Hey Arjuna, <coughs> Yam imam pushvitam vacham pravadanti avipaschitaha veda vadarata patha nanya dastidi vadinaha. Veda vadarata patha ye patha. They are interested only in Vedas. Vedas means Upanishad also is a part of Vedas only. But here Veda means on the karma part of Veda. The rishis. Or the, the sadhaks, those who are interested only in Veda, karma part, Veda, Vadarada, Pata, Nanyata, Asthiti, Vadinaha. They, they are telling that there is uh, nothing more than the heaven. Heaven is the highest uh, the state we have, where we have to go and enjoy this pleasures. Kamatmanaha, Swarga Paraha, Janma, Karma, Palaprada. Kamatmana, they have so much of desire. Swarga para, para. Not Moksha para, they are Swarga para. Sorgabara, Janma Karma Palapradam. So these actions are giving the Janma mood. Kriya Vishesha Bahulam, Bogaishwarya Badim Gadim Prati. Kriya Vishesha, they are endowed with so much of the glamorous um, rituals. Boga Aishwarya Prasaktam, they are attached to the Boga and Aishwarya, glory. Uh, what do you call it? The prosperity. Attached with pleasures and pl prosperities. Their mind is completely taken away by the enjoyment, the enjoyment, the pleasure of this world and that world. Surgapara. Vyavasayatmika buddhihi samadhauna vidiyate. Because they are completely engaged with this activity, they do not have buddhi to get knowledge. Brahma vidya. Samadhauna vidiyate. That is a problem. Our scriptures are telling you how to do the karma. Karma is meant uh, to clean the mind. It's not the goal, it's a path. The, it should be very clear. Okay? The Vedic period, these rishis, 
are very much attached with the karma. Therefore, Krishna is uh, not criticizing, he is um, removing the block on the way. People are telling Krishna is criticizing karma. No, no, no. Krishna never criticizes karma. So he makes them understand the purpose of karma. Chittasa shuddhaya karma. The purpose of karma is chitta shuddhi only. So karma has got some purpose. This is not the criticism what Krishna is doing in Bhagavad Gita. He makes very clear about how you have to use the karma. Okay? When you are attached with the karma and activity, the fruits of action, you will not get mind for the knowledge, for that only. And he says in the ninth chapter also, he says, suppose the, you are very busy with the activities, rituals. Trividya mama soma pa puta pa pa. Trividya means those who follow the Chatur Veda. Sometimes the Vedas are four, sometimes Vedas are three. Other than Vedas not included. He is talking more about the worldly efforts. Therefore, Trividya means Rig Yaju Sama. Sometimes three, three Veda, sometimes four Veda. Both are right only. According to the context, we have to understand that. Trividya mama soma pa puta pa pa. Yagnya rishto swargadim prata yente. They follow the Vedic rituals. And they go to Sargulog. Sargadim Prata and they tear Punya Vasa, they surrender Lokam. They went to, they, they go to surrender Lokam. Indra, who rules that world, surrender Lokam. Tear Punya Vasa, they surrender Lokam. Ashtanti Divyana, Divi Deva Boga, Deva Boga. From one country to they go to another country. Why you are interested in another country? Bogas, Boga. When I go to that country, nobody is asking, why you are drinking? Hey, I bought money, this is my money, I drink. Why you smoking? Hey, my cigarette. Why are you enjoying? Hey, nobody asking, why are you asking? The free society, you can enjoy. Boga Bhumi. Not only you find that kind of Boga Bhumi in the, in the, on the earth. So much more Bogas there in the Surendra Loga. Nobody will ask. It's only... Meant to enjoy. Okay, they they punya masadhyay. They collect punya because of the rituals and the Vedic uh, uh, karmas. Punya masurendra loka mashnandi divyan divi deva boga. Divine, uh, what do you call divine pleasures. When we enjoy pleasure here, boge roga bayam. <laughs> when we enjoy too much here, indel, roga is there. It's a nature of uh, worldly pleasure. Divi deva boga. When I go to Swargoloka, when, when we enjoy that, there will not be any roga. Only exhaustion is there. That's all. The punyas will be exhausted. There is no roga. Tetam bhukto Swargolokam vishal. Vishala. There's varieties out there. So much varieties. Vishala. Enjoying. Shine punye matyalokam vishanti. I have to bring that kind of sound only. Shine punya but shine punya matalokam vishanti. Once they exhaust the punya, they are coming back. Uh, they are coming back and they get space in the womb of the mother. Ado karvam prasanga the kalayati karusham, matru kukshastitam, matru kuksham, they go into womb. Yevam tri dharma anu prapana, yevam tri dharma, those who follow are attached to the rituals of the Vedic Vedas. Gata, Gatam, Kama, Kama, Labande, they are very busy to go to Sargoloka, very busy to come back, very busy to going coming. Gata, Gata, Kama, Kama, Labande. Because they are, uh, they have so much of desire, they do this Vedic activities and they go come back. So this is, um, this is how they lead their life. Ninth chapter also Krishna brings the same point. Second chapter, ninth chapter, he says, the limitation of uh, Vedic rituals. That's all. So he's not telling that this is wrong. This is okay. It's okay. If you endured with this desire, if you have desires, then desires can be fulfilled through this kind of Vedic rituals. But that's not goal, Arjuna. That's not goal. Okay. So you have to use this activity to clean your mind and get knowledge, get moksha. Okay, this limitation of the act, um, rituals are explained in Bhagavad Gita, second chapter, ninth chapter. This is what all the rishis were doing, Darukavana. 
So for getting higher goal, the lower goal they have taken. And so it's compassionate Lord Shiva, they, he came and he taught them, hey, this is not the goal. You are very sincere people, very devoted, very sincere, very good people. Because out of compassion only I have come here. Please, you take up this path and move forward. Okay? Sincere people, very sincere, devoted. And they are stuck with some other goal. So he turns, the direction is turned and showing their tunnel path. Is it okay? This is the background. Now, so karma. When you do karma, the karma, because of the karma, we attach with the karma, we go to heaven. <clears throat> After enjoying this, again come back to birth. Okay? Again busy with the karma. Karma, heaven, birth, karma. Karma, samsa. Janma, karma, palapradha. Kriya, vishesha, bhagala. Sir, that's okay. In those days, they were doing rituals. We are not doing rituals now. How can you bring that point to the modern uh, world? Yeah, the question is going on your mind. I can understand. In Bhagavad Gita, second chapter, nine chapter, that's okay. In those days, 5,000 years back, now we are living modern world. So in the modern world, when we donate to the temple, to do Kumbhavashek, asam anadana, a construct some ashram, something, some. That is also false under the category of rituals. Okay? I give this money. I do this kind of sponsorship to print book Bhagavad Gita or Purana. <laughs> I donate. When I donate, I do this as a ritual. So I get punya, I go to heaven. After that, I will come back. You getting it? All our activities. Our physical, uh, what is that? Um, also we are giving. Physically, we help and uh, we give some, uh, what do you call this, um, mind treatment, uh, psychological treatment. So whatever we have, we give the so rituals. And out of that ritual, we get punya, we go to higher world. So in the modern world, we have to understand like that only. The purpose of karma is not to get punya. The purpose of karma is to clean the mind. So that is what Krishna says here, Lord Shiva also. Uh, stitching these rishis. So it is going like that. Now, when we come to uh, the path of knowledge, the path of knowledge is taking another direction. The karma should purify. The purpose of karma, chitta shuddhaye karma. Bhagavan Adishankara Acharya says in Vivek Shudhavani. So instead of going back like this, so you have to move forward. Karma should purify your mind. Purification of mind brings the self-knowledge. Self-knowledge brings liberation. Is it okay? We have to go forward, not the Bhagavad. This is what Krishna uh, taught in Bhagavad Gita, second chapter, ninth chapter. Lord Shiva is giving this knowledge, the rishis, those who are living in Darukavan. Is it okay? You should not go backward, you should go forward. The purpose of karma to purify. Whole Bhagavad Gita, 18 chapter, Krishna again and again is repeating. Without attachment, without attachment, without attachment. You are boring now. How many times you repeat? Because you don't understand, therefore I am repeating. <laughs> Once you understand, then I will not repeat. You are not getting Arjuna. Okay? Repeatedly he says in Bhagavad Gita. Okay? This is the, the background of karma. The purpose of karma is to purific, purification of the mind, not to get punya. <laughs> karma is very peculiar. If we expect uh, the fruit of action, then we will get punya, we will go to other world. We will get all the fruits of punya. When we do not expect, then that, that gives purity. There are two kinds of fruit we are getting it. We are getting it. Two kinds of fruit out of same action. The same action when we do so, I am giving uh, money to print Bhagavad Gita. Okay, Thousand copies of Bhagavad Gita. I, oh, okay, one lakh of Bhagavad Gita to print this book. I'm giving my donation. Yeah. When I give you money, suppose a thousand dollars, story say, okay, thousand dollars, thousand dollars. With what uh, attitude we give? 
I give thousand dollars. I earned money, my money. I give to print Bhagavad one lakh, one lakh only. I told her one lakh. That one lakh happy okay. Small. The what attitude I I give when I when I print this book and distribute, I get the blessings of Lord Krishna. I get punya. Then we go back. Is it okay? Because we need to get the fruits of action. Sir, I want to get the uh, fruits. So we go back. Maybe we are taken to Vaikundu Loka instead of uh, Zorgo Loka. It's okay. Somewhere we'll go and we'll come back again. Why? Karma, the Punya karma is exhausted. We come back. Here, one more, uh, um, the fruit we are getting out of the karma. I don't want anything. I get very nice chance to uh, print the book. I have given the donation. I have forgotten everything. That's all. Money belongs to Lord. The book also belongs to Lord. This is very nice chance I get in my life given. Not expecting anything. So when we when we do the same karma, it will bring purity. Are you getting it? So karma gives two kinds of fruits. With the expectation, it gives heaven or something, punya. Without the uh, um, expectation, purity comes. Some The karma has got the ability to give different uh, fruits of action. One, fruits of, one fruit is purity, another fru fruit is heaven. Getting it? When you expect, heaven comes. When you don't expect, purity comes. So, very nice kind of um, the quality of karma. Not quality, the ability of karma. Okay, ability of karma. Are you getting it now? So, Krishna says, with you, <laughs> yeah, don't expect, Ra. Don't expect. If Without expecting, if you do, you get purity. Purity is more than this. Once if you get purity, you are not going to lose it. It takes a higher uh, uh, joy, bliss. But if you expect uh, you are getting heaven, but again you are coming back, Arjuna. So uh, Krishna is showing more profit than smaller one. Getting it? That is Bhagavad Gita. Same effort. Why are you what are the spending money? You could take money and keep it in the, uh, the forward direction. I hope you are getting the point. But Krishna shows more, how to get more. Our attitude also is, I have to invest a little, but to get more. Where can I get more? Uh, Krishna says, I will show you how to get more. Okay? We understood this. So, through karma, we get purity, knowledge, and liberation. But here, these rishis are sitting in Darugavanam and doing rituals to get heaven. Again, they will come back. So, the Lord, whether it is Krishna or Lord Shiva, they are very compassionate showing the right path. Therefore, they came and they directed this rishis. Is it okay? Now, so this Lord Shiva came in the form of Brahmachari. It's very difficult to get Lord Shiva in the Brahmachari farm. Therefore, I brought Lord Shiva. You imagine that he took <laughs> a Bhikshadana Murti and went there. Now, Bhagavan, Ramana Magrishi composed this um, Upadesha Saram. Upadesha Saram has got four the sections. The first one, Karma Yoga, he explains. First three slokas are explaining Karma Yoga. Okay? And next, uh, uh, seven slokas from fourth sloka to tenth sloka is explaining Bhakti Yoga. Very interesting. Bhakti. And next, what are six slokas? Dhyana Yoga. How to do meditation. Dhyana. And remaining in the slokas, 14 slokas, Jnana Yoga. So all yogas he brought here. Karma, Bhakti, Dhyana, and Jnana Yoga. Very beautifully brought. Therefore, this is called a Saram. Saram is essence. What is Upadesha Saram? Upadesha Saram. It gives this message to the Rishis. So, Upadesha Saram has got 30 slokas. Okay? The first we are going to take this Karma Yoga. How many times we study Karma Yoga? Here also Karma Yoga. Huh? How many times we read, so many times we get the clarity. Okay? They should not think that I studied Karma Yoga so many times. I am already doing Karma Yoga. Why? Sir, you studied Karma Yoga. 
Suppose somebody is asking you, tell me karma yoga. Karma yoga means karma yoga, that's all. We have to do our karma without expectations. That there are so many things to reflect upon that karma yoga. Okay? Now we will start reflecting. The first topic he, he, he Brahman Magarishi um, brought karma yoga. The first sloka. Okay? This is a, the original. Original uh, Tamil also he brought. Those who know Tamil, you can read it. Okay? So, doubly blessed. Three language. Three language concept in India. Now, new education policy. India brings three language. <laughs> we are having three language at a stretch. This is very popular. Karturagnyaya prapete palam karma kimparam karma tajadam. Very nice uh, song. I think many of you are chanting in your uh, mission center. Kartuhu Agnaya Prapete Palam Karma Kimparam Karma Tajar. Very small, very short, very small, very sweet. Okay. Kartuhu Agnaya. I mean, the command of the creator, Kartuhu Agnaya, Palam Prapete. We are getting fruits of action. How we are getting fruit of action? Because of the command of the creator. Agnya. Agnya means command, the order. Okay, we are not getting, so we are not doing our own action. We are not getting our own action fruit of the, immediately. We have all the right to do only action. Only the creator has got the command to give the reaction. You getting it? Otherwise, we make our own karma, immediately we'll get, we will get fruit. He understands that, hey, these people are very dangerous. They do karma, they will take a reaction. Fruits of action immediately. Many people are that without doing uh, karma, they get only fruit. So, Lord understands that hey, you only you have a right in the action. Reaction, I only have right. Kartuha agnya palam prapit because of his command only. Is it okay? Karma kimparam. Um, then, how is action the all supreme? Karma kimparam. So, he is asking question. Ka karma kimparam? Karma param? So, action is a supreme? No. Why karma tajadam? Karma is jadam. Insentient, inert. The action is inert. Karma is jadam. Karma is not param. This karma pala we are getting uh, what that? because of Lord's command. The three points he brought. Is it okay? Therefore, karma is not supreme. Karma is not supreme. That is jadam. And that uh, karma, when we do, the reaction is given by Almighty Lord. The first sloka itself says that, therefore, you are engaged with all rituals, of the Vedic rituals. So that ritual is not the supreme. That's a tool through which you can get the supreme. So this point is very clear. This, no? we, so we, we, we go to Vedanta class and we study Vedanta. We can understand this directly. In those days, rishis, first they struck up with this kind of karma, then again, Lord comes and he gives the right direction. They move from that place, karma to jnana. We are very lucky. The beginning itself, he understood jnana is glorious. <laughs> we don't have this kind of problem. Getting it or not. <laughs> we never understood that karma is everything. No. The beginning itself, we understand jnana is greater than karma. So we have to thank all our great Acharyas. Our Gurudev, Tapor Maharaj, Vivekananda Swami, Ramana Magrishi, Ramakrishna, we have to thank you. We never struck here. Those days, Rishis, they struck here and they moved from this place. Okay? Karturagnaya Prapeta Palam. So you are worshipping only karma. You are behind karma. Karma is not supreme. It's jadam only. Lord only brings this fruits. You want to understand this point, number, first point, number one, okay? We will think about this. We will have some thought on this. And this, uh, Tamil, those who know Tamil for them, the double E, it's bonus for them. I will read it, you can understand, okay? Kanmam, Kanmam. What is this Kanmam? Kanmam means Karmam. Okay, in pure Tamil, Kanmam. Kanmam Payantaral, Kanmam Payantaral. Karmam Payantaral. <laughs> If you see the Tamil, 
கர்மம் பயன்தரல் கர்ம பயன்தரல் கர்த்தனது ஆணையால் கர்த்தனது ஆர்டர் ஆஃப் தி லார்ட் கர்த்தா த கர்ம கிவ்ஸ் ஃப்ரூட் பிகாஸ் ஆஃப் த கமாண்ட் ஆஃப் த லார்ட் கர்மம் பயன்தரல் கர்த்தனது ஆணையால் கர்மம் கடவுளோ உந்தி பெற கர்மம் கடவுளோ இஸ் ஆஸ்கிங் இஸ் ஹவு ஆக்ஷன் இஸ் ஆல் சுப்ரீம் கர்மம் கடவுளோ ஜஸ் கர்ம இஸ் ஆல் சுப்ரீம் லார்ட் ஆல் பைட்டி நோ கர்மம் கடவுளோ கர்மம் ஜடம் அதால் உந்தி பெற கர்மம் ஜடம் மீன்ஸ் கர்ம இஸ் ஜட யூ சி திஸ் This is the original one and from this only he translated into Sanskrit. Undi para, undi para means we say the Sabutri. Sabutri, and undi para. We play this song, or the, the game. When you are very small, that is called undi para. Okay? Undi para means through game he uh, brought that um, sloka. Karmam payantharal kartana dhanayal kanmang kadavulo undi para. Karmam sadamadal undi para. This is first we studied. because we studied in sandeep and tamil nadu we didn't do this <laughs> we didn't study upadesha we studied upadesha undi or as it is this is what gurudev asked us so our gurudev had that vision even though this is that in sanskrit if you learn through tamil sandeep ani you read this as it is this vision this vision suppose if you do malayalam then whatever the malayala great saints brought uh, vedanta you do it in malayalam if it's telugu do it in telugu okay so we are very lucky we learned sanskrit also already we know tamil we are doubly blessed okay you, of course english is there now kartana okay kartu agnya prapete pala because of the command of the lord we get fruit so karma is not supreme karma is jada okay now shall you think upon this shloka about this shloka we will bring thoughts on this astika darshanas we have six astika darshanas astika means all these people they accept veda as their pramana veda pramana they accept veda pramana those who do not accept veda prana veda pramana that is called nastik darshana what are the nastik darshanas bauddha jaina and charvaka so we are not bringing those three nastik darshana those who do not take ved vedas as their pramana they do not get any support from veda pramana all the six uh, schools of thought they take vedas as their pramana authority because veda says like that therefore i bring this idea all the six people okay sankhya philosophy the founder of sankhya philosophy kapila magarishi yoga philosophy patanjali rishi nyaya philosophy gautama vaisheshika kanada purva mimamsa jaimini uttara mimamsa bhagavan vedavyas uttara mimamsa adra is called vedanta all the six uh, uh, thing in upadesha sara why are we bring all this it is needed is this upadesha sara or brahma sutra yeah i am going to bring the brahma sutra also oh you you we thought that this is a very simple book no it is a saram saram means what we need to have the uh, more references okay now we are going to take the sankhya purva mimamsa and uttara mimamsa we will take this three and we will analyze just okay among this six six schools of philosophy we are very great person when we take sanatan dharma we have so much of uh, what that the intellectual philosophies if you are the person if you are a person with the intellect then you have so much to study in your life okay now it puru mimamsa the founder of puru mimamsa is jaimini jaimini magarishi okay now the puru mimamsa so they are more the karma karma gandhi like this rishis all this if you are very much interested in rituals so i want to get the pleasure in this world not only in this world swarga paraha so i belong to this puro mimamsa my founder is jaimini yeah, i believe in that way okay my so this puro mimamsa people those who follow jaimini so we have to understand that jaimini is none other than the rishi Uh, Sishya of Bhagavan <laughs> Vedavyasa. 
Okay. Even though he is a Rishi, the disciple of Veda Vyasa, he has got his own thought, the freedom in thought. It's not necessary I have to follow my guru as it is. He is my guru, but I have my own philosophy. So, Jaimini Magarishi says that. No karma pala data. So, he, the philosophy in this, um, in this school of thought, they don't want to have any karma pala data. There is no Ishwara here discussed. In Puro Mimamsa, there is no Ishwara is discussed. The concept of Ishwara is not there in Puro Mimamsa. Ayyayya. Ah. Then how they get the fruits of action? In Pura Mimamsa, they are telling that no karma pala data is needed. It is unnecessary for us. Tevil. Then how are you getting this karma pala? They, they are telling, sir, karma has got the ability, the karma has got the ability to give fruits. That ability is called apurva. So they are bringing the word apurva. You are getting it? Apurva, the word, the concept. Every action has the ability to give reaction. Why unnecessarily you are bringing one more person as karma pala data? We don't want that karma pala data. Karma itself has got the ability to give reaction. Are you getting the point? See the philosophical thought. So those people, they are convinced with this kind of thought, they fall under the category of pura mimamsa. That's all. One of the school of thought. They cannot say this is right or wrong. They are convinced. That's all. I hope we are getting this. Yeah? Interesting. Very nice. The freedom of thought is there in our system. Sorry. Yes, they are very good. So every action has the ability to give a reaction, sir. If you do good, you will get good. If you do bad, you will get bad. If you do not do anything, you will not get anything. That's all. <laughs> you are not writing examination for... Your number will be there, but result will not be there. Why? You didn't appear for that. You did well. Nice reaction. Nice result. You did bad. Bad reaction. That's all. So every karma has got the ability to give action, reaction. That's all. So that ability is called purva. Apurva. Okay. Therefore, we do not want any karma pala data. There is no concept of Vishwara in Purva Mimamsa. You get it? Now, Bhagavan, our Raman Magarishi says that, hey, kartu rajnaya prapete palam karma kimparam karma jajam. Are you getting the connection now? Karma doesn't have ability to give fruit itself. Karma will give fruit because of the command, the, the command of Almighty Lord. You are getting it or not? So therefore, he says that the poor mimam, so what you are thinking is not right. You may think you are right, but that is not such. In our logic, so it is not fitting here. But according to your logic, you say, Apurva gives fruits of action unnecessary. They are not telling we are non-believers. You have to understand that poor mimam, so people are not non-believers. So they say that we are not telling there is no God. We are telling we don't want God. <laughs> Unnecessary unity you are bringing. You're getting it? So we are not telling there is no, we are not denying. So we are telling we don't want that all. Let him be there, but we, we don't want. Unnecessary uh, the agent here this is what they say. Is it okay? So there is no karma paladar. Bhagavan Raman Magrishi says it is not like that. Karthuragnaya prapete palam. Karma will not give fru, uh, uh, reaction as it is. Now you're going to second philosophy, Sankhya philosophy. The Sankhya philosophy, uh, the founder of Sankhya philosophy, Kapila Maharishi. He says here, no Jagat Karta. <laughs> so these people are telling there is no Jagat Karta. Jagat is um, happened itself. So these people are telling there is no concept of Ishwara. We also don't want Ishwara. Uh, you, you. Hmm. There is no Ishwara Puja and Dal. There is no Ishwara Puja in Pura Mimamsa. There is no Puja in the Sankhya philosophy. Then how the world has been created? A Sankhya philosophy, these people are telling Purusha and Prakriti, two great concepts. We are very familiar with the two words. Krishna also brings these two words in the Bhagavad Gita. Purusha and Prakriti. 
So what they are telling, Purusha is pure, Chaitanya Murti. Purusha is all pervading, pure. This Prakriti created the 24 aspects of the universe and he created, the Prakriti only created the universe. <coughs> how Prakriti created the universe like in the, mag in the presence of magnet, how the, uh, the dust of iron pieces are moving in the same way. In the presence of Purusha, Prakriti creates this world. So there is no uh, a connection between Pur Prakriti and Purusha. Prakriti is different, Purusha is different. So, Purusha is not responsibility for the creation. The presence of Purusha, Prakriti is creating. Are you getting the point? This is their philosophy. Therefore, Purusha is not creating the world. In the, in the presence of Purusha, Prakriti is creating this universe. Therefore, there is no Jagat Karta here. Only Jagat only is there. So there is no Ishwara concept here. Here there is no Ishwara concept. There is no Jagat Karta. Here there is no Ishwara. There is no Karma Bala Data. So Karma Bala Data also out. Jagat Karta also out. <laughs> two philosophies. Two people are not. Same people, but two functions are not there. Finish. So therefore there is a, all these two philosophies are Nirishwara Vada. Nirishwara Mada means they are not denying that there is no uh, Ishwara. They are telling Ishwara, Ishwara is unnecessary agent for us. They will. No need. Are you getting it? So there is a difference between denying completely and there is no need. So these people are telling there is no need here. We are very clear. Those people, they are very, very much convinced with this, they follow Sankhya. Those people, they are very much convinced with this. They follow Purva Mimamsa. People are there to convince this kind of idea. We cannot uh, ask that how can is this, po this is possible. Ah, it's possible. People are there. You know, now also people are following this Sankhya philosophy. And now Bhagavan Adi Shankara Acharya and Bhagavan Veda Vyasa, they bring this together. Jagat Karta is there, Karma Pala Data is there. Okay? Are you getting it? Now, the Vedanta. When you come to Vedanta, Bhagavan Vedavyas as a founder, he brought this uh, Brahma Sutra, Bhagavad Gita and Upanishad, upon which our Bhagavan Adi Shankaraj is writing commentary. Now, Jagat Karta is there, Karma Pala Data is there. Ishwara, the concept of Ishwara, these two people brought. Bhagavan Vedavyas, Bhagavan Adi Shankaraj. Okay, Ishwara comes. He, because of Ishwara, he only creates this universe. If it is Brahman, there is no creation. The Brahman has the power of Maya. The Brahman united with the power of Maya, he becomes Ishwara. Ishwara has the ability to create this universe. So, Jagat Karta. Janma Adhyasa Yataha. Okay, Jagat Karta is there. That Jagat Karta only creates this karma and karma pala he only gives. He is karma pala data. So the concept of Ishwara is very much convinced in Vedanta. They brought their own logic. Are you getting it? So now our first sloka, first <coughs> sloka from um, Upadesha Sara says, Kartu Ragnaya Prapyate Palam. The fruit we are getting because of the Karta. Karta of what? Jagat. So, Jagat Karta, are you getting it? Jagat Karta. One who created the Jagat only can give this Palam. Kartu Ragnaya Prapyate Palam. So, his Karma Paladata is Jagat Karta. Who is that? Ishwara. Ishwara is there. Sir, if there is no Ishwara, where you are going to offer the action of uh, fruits of action? So you have fruits of where you have to offer, you have to offer this to someone else. The only it will be exhausted. Otherwise, fruit of action is hanging somewhere else. You're getting it. Therefore, Krishna is repeatedly telling that Mai Sarvani Karmani Sanyasya, Mai Karmani Sanskarman, Mai Sarvani Karma. Again and again he repeats. You need to have someone to offer, then only purification of mind comes. Are you okay? Is this too much for you? This is clear. This is simple thought I brought. Too much I am going to give now. What? Yes. 
There's so many things to uh, reflect upon this look. Now, are you ready? Will you go a little deeper? Bhagavan, Pedavyasa Brad Brahma Sutra. 555 sutras he wrote. Bhagavan Adi Shankar Acharya's commented on Brahma Sutra. Now you'll get a few sutras. We'll study. It is very easy, easy one, easy. One. Don't get frightened. Okay. So this, this um, shloka needs that support. This is a Brahma Sutra, second chapter, third uh, padam. Easy, easy one, easy one. Cool, cool. Karta. Shastra Artavatvat Karta. Who is Karta? Uh, jiva is a Karta. Jiva is doing karma. Karta cha ayam jiva syat. We are doing action. Okay, we, are, we are Karta. Kasmate, why we become Karta? Now that Karta is Jagat Karta. Excuse me. There are two Kartas. One karta, we are doing action. Another karta, who, who created this world. That karta is different, this karta is different. We are doing the action, okay? When we do action, kasmatu sastra artavatvatu yevam cha yajete juhiyatu dadhyatu ityevam vidam vidhi shastram vidhi shastram artavatu bhavati. The scriptures are telling that you do this yaga, you do this homam, you do this kind of charity. Yajete, Juhyatu, Dadhyatu. The Sastras are telling. All the Sastras will become very meaningful okay, when we become Karta. If Karta is not there, Sastras will not tell, do this, don't do this. Because Sastra says like that, you do this, so we become Karta. So we are the doer. Okay? Anyata tadanarthakam syat. Otherwise, Sastras will become waste. There's no use for the Sastra. So, Sastras are there and it is telling that you do this, you do that. So, we become Karta. Okay? Jiva, so we become Karta. Are you okay? Now, when we become Karta, when we do something, we are not making that fruit. That's the point here. Only 50 percentage. So, this uh, uh, that, um, uh, Sutra says, Karta, Shastra, Artha, Artha, We become uh, doer of the action. Why? Scriptures are telling that you do this, you do this, you do. Therefore, we are doing it. All good karma. So we become karma. We become karta. When we do, when we become karta, we we become bhokta. We are not ourselves. We become data of karma. The fruits of action. The sutra I brought here, jiva is a karta. Jiva is not making any what that fruits of action. Only 50 percentage is action. Another 50 percentage, who gives the fruit? Now comes the second, uh, next uh, the sutra. Are you, are you clear? Okay. okay. We, we are the karta. Then who gives this fruit? Karma paladata. Palamata uvapatte. Another adhikaranam. This is paladikaranam. This is third chapter. Second part. Lord gives the fruit. You see, we do action. And Lord gives fruit. Is it okay? We do action according to this sutra. And who gives uh, fruit? Karam palam atha upapatte atha. Now see. Tata ta, tatra tavatu pratipadete palam. Then we get fruit. We are not ourselves creating the fruit. Otherwise, we do action, we create fruit according to our wish. Luckily, we don't have that ability. <laughs> Otherwise, we do bad karma, but we get good karma. We create good karma as fruit. So we have only the right and action. Karta, that's all. Just move that way. Who gives fruit? Palam ataha. From, from where? Palam ataha means Ishwarati bhavitu margasi. Ishwara only gives palam. Are you getting it now? So Vedanta says there is a concept of Ishwara. Ishwara only brings fruit. But Mimamsa says that we do not want any Ishwara. Karma itself will create fruit. So Bhagavan Adi Shankaracharya comes, Bhagavan Veda Vyasa says, that, no, 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 not like that. Palam Ataha, from Ishwara to Bhavit Marhati. Ishwara is needed. Why? Karturagniya Prapyate Palam. Some commander should be there to give fruit. Okay? 
ಕುತಃ ಉಭಪತ್ತೆ ವೈ ಯು ಆರ್ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಶ್ವರ ದರ್ ಉಭಪತ್ತೆ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ಲಾಜಿಕ್ ಇನ್ ಇಟ್ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ಲಾಜಿಕ್ ಉಭಪತಿ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಫಲಂ ಅತಃ ಫಲಂ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಗೆಟಿಂಗ್ ಫ್ರೂಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಹಿಮ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಹೋಮ್ ಈಶ್ವರ ಉಭಪತ್ತೆ ಉಭಪತಿ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ಲಾಜಿಕ್ ಇನ್ ಇಟ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಲಾಜಿಕ್ ಸಹಿ ಸರ್ವಾಧ್ಯಕ್ಷ ದ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಹೂ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟೆಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಯೂನಿವರ್ಸ್ ಸರ್ವ ಅಧ್ಯಕ್ಷ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಓನರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಕೋಆರ್ಡಿನೇಟರ್ ಅಧ್ಯಕ್ಷ ಸೃಷ್ಟಿ ಸ್ಥಿತಿ ಸಂಹಾರ ಹಿ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಿ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಸಸ್ಟೈನ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಹಿ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಡಿಸಾಲ್ವ್ಸ್ ಸಂಹಾರ ವಿಚಿತ್ರಾನ್ ವಿದತ್ ವಿಚಿತ್ರ ಆಲ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ವೆರಿ ವಂಡರ್ಸ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ದೇಶ ಕಾಲ ವಿಜೇ ವಿಶೇಷ ಅಭಿಜ್ಞತ್ವಾದ್ ಹಿ ನೋಸ್ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ ದೇಶ ಕಾಲ ಅಭಿಜ್ಞ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಹಿ ನೋಸ್ ಆಲ್ ದೇಶ ಆಲ್ ಕಾಲ್ ಕಂಟ್ರೋಲರ್ ಆಫ್ ಎವ್ರಿಥಿಂಗ್ ಕರ್ಮಿನಾಂ ಕರ್ಮಾನ್ ರೂಪಂ ಫಲಂ ಸಂಪಾದಯತಿ ವಾಟ್ ಎವರ್ ದ ಕರ್ಮ ದ ಜೀವಸ್ ಆರ್ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ದರ್ ಕರ್ಮ ಫಲಂ ಕರ್ಮಾನು ರೂಪಂ ಫಲಂ ಸಂಪಾದಿತ್ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ದರ್ ಆಕ್ಷನ್ ಹಿ ಗಿವ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರೂಟ್ ಉತ್ಪದ್ಯತೆ ಸೊ ಹಿ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಬ್ರಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಹಿ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟೆಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟರ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಬ್ರಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ದ ಆಕ್ಷನ್ ದ ಫ್ರೂಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಕ್ಷನ್ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ದ ಜೀವ ವೆರಿ ಗುಡ್ ದರ್ ಇಸ್ ಈಶ್ವರ ಈಶ್ವರ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಗಿವ್ಸ್ ದ ಫಲಂ ಫಲಂ ಅಥ ಉಪಪತ್ತೆ ವೈ ದಿಸ್ ಅ ಲಾಜಿಕ್ ಯು ಸಿ ದೋ ಸಂಪಡಿ ಇಸ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟೆಡ್ ವೆರಿ ಸಿಂಪಲಿ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸಿ ತ್ರೂ ಯುಸ್ ಬುದ್ಧಿ ದ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಹೂ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟೆಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಗಿವ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರೂಟ್ ವೆರಿ ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ಲಾಜಿಕ್ ಓಕೆ ಅಕಾರ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಲಾಜಿಕಲ್ ಥಿಂಕಿಂಗ್ ದ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟರ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಬ್ರಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರೂಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ವೇದಾಂತ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ವೈ ವಿ ಶುಡ್ ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಸೂತ್ರ ವೆನ್ ಯು ರೀಡ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಸೂತ್ರ ವಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಕನ್ವಿಕ್ಷನ್ so our conviction will not be shaken getting it see puro mimamsa says we don't want ishwaraya why karma itself gives fruit they say no, the vedanta says no 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 it is not like that karma cannot give how can you say upapatti is there just a small logic you, you watch this whole universe somebody created this and he only sustains and he only destroys who is that power so that power only creates gives the fruit of action okay now not only i bring according to my logic the vedas also says like that are you getting it now they are bringing the support of vedas are you getting it therefore this uh, school of thought belongs to astik darshana okay so when you read brahma sutra and all the buddhi also comes and the scripture also comes first is according to my understanding the person who created he only can give fruit not only my buddhi says shrute is shrutatvascha shruti also is there na kevalam upapatte reva na kevalam upapatte not merely by my intellectual understanding i am telling this getting it see how bhagwan adi shankar is writing commentary ನ ಕೇವಲ ಉಪಪತ್ತೇರೇವ ಈಶ್ವರಂ ಫಲಹೇತು ಕಲ್ಪ್ಯಮಾನ ಈಶ್ವರ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಗಿವ್ಸ್ ಫಲ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಮಿಯರ್ಲಿ ಮೈ ಥಿಂಕ್ ಮೈ ಇಮ್ಯಾಜಿನೇಷನ್ ಮೈ ಥಿಂಕಿಂಗ್ ಆರ್ ಮೈ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಕಿಂ ತರ್ಹಿ ಶ್ರುತತ್ವಾತ್ ಅಪಿ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಆಸ್ಕ್ ಅನದರ್ ರೀಸನ್ ಶ್ರುತಿ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಸೇಸ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಈಶ್ವರಮೇವ ಫಲಹೇತು ಮನ್ಯಾವಹೆ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಶ್ರುತಿ ಸಪೋರ್ಟ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ಈಶ್ವರ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಗಿವ್ಸ್ ಅ ಫ್ರೂಟ್ therefore we have to study then and there brahma sutra also <laughs> to get more conviction getting it sir simply he told our maravana magrishi ishwara agnya prapita palam you stop there go to next shloka why are you bringing all those things because you are following more than 2 3 years the online course you know all of you studying purana idigas everything students like you should know these things therefore i brought all those things getting it serious students even though you laugh you are serious students only i know serious in thoughts okay <laughs> shruti also says okay tatacha shrutir bhavati shruti says i am getting the support of shruti therefore the asik darshana sava esha mahan aja that great glorious lord aja he is birthless atman atma annadaha vasudanaha so he only gives food and he only gives all glories okay he brings this support from brihadaranya 
Bhagavad-Gita Upanishad support he brings and he says that not only according to my understanding or through my buddhi or logic, um, scripture also says like that. Therefore, okay, it's a pramana. So my intellectual understanding, buddhi, at the same time, getting the support from Shruti also. The point here, the person who created this world and he only brings, he only gives a karma pala. Karthu ragnaya prapite pala. Karma is not param. Ishwara is param. Karma is jadam. Therefore, don't worship karma. Use the karma as a tool for the knowledge. You worship Ishwara instead of karma. This is what he gives the direction. Okay? Now, jiva, karma, karma, karta and bhokta. So, jiva is doing karma and jiva is bhokta. He enjoys. Ishwara, the concept of Ishwara comes with jagat karta and karma phala data. You getting it? Without his what that um, uh, fruits of so he gives, so he without he gives the fruit we cannot what that enjoy the fruit. So when we do karma, when we do we become karta. So we we will be waiting to get <laughs> get the fruit. Who is giving? Ishwara only should give the our uh, the fruit. Then only we start enjoying it. Otherwise, what happens? We do our own karma. We create our own karma pala there immediately itself, okay? And we start enjoying it. It's not like that. We do karma and we are waiting it. Ishwara, the creator of the Jagat only, he knows when to give, how much to give. So he gives, then he starts enjoying it. Are you getting it? Therefore, there is a Ishwara, Karturagnaya, Palam Prapyate. Is this convincing now? Yeah. So making our point so strong, Therefore, we studied a few sutras from Brahma Sutra. I were getting it. Getting it or not? Now, Ishwara is doing two kinds of work. Give her a fruit of action. Data, data, this data, okay? And creator of fruit of action, creator. Not only he gives the fruit and he only created this karma should have this fruit. Are you getting it? The programmer. So he is a programmer and he is only the, what do you, what do you call, uh, the function. He only brings the function. He only created that. Okay. His name is Vidhata. In Vishnu Sahasanama, Bhagavan Adi Shankaracharya writes a commentary for what is the meaning of Vidhata. Karmanam tat palanam sa karta Vidhata. He created the karma. This karma should, should bring this kind of fruit. That is also programmed by the Almighty Lord. What kind of karma, what amount of karma should bring this kind of fruit at what time? It is decided by the Almighty Lord. Therefore, his name is Vidatha. Karma nam karma pala nam se karta. Karta creator. So he's a programmer of the computer, sir. Programmer of the computer. Software engineer. Okay. So we are using that computer. But who created this software? This is the person. Ishwara. What kind of karma should bring what kind of action at what time? At what amount? Somebody should create. Le? So therefore his name is Vidhata. He's a creator of action. The fruit of action. At the same time, he's a giver of fruit of action. He only created, he only brings. Then what is the role of jiva? We do karma. That's we do karma and we, we are standing there waiting for the fruits of action. The creator only brings. So he is data, he is vidhata. Here this da is fourth da. Here this da is third da. Data, giver. Vidhata, creator. So we are getting the support from Vishnu Sahasrama, Bhagavan Adi Shankara Acharya's commentary. Okay, now see, what kind of seed? We have only right to sow the seed. And what day it should come out? Okay, which kind of uh, the plant should come? It is decided by Almighty Lord. Why? He is Vidhata. Karmanam tat palanam cha karta. Are you getting the point? Therefore, Ramana Magrishi says that Kartuhu Agnya Palam Prapyate. 
ஒரு பியூட்டிஃபுல் லைன் உதயசார் கர்த்து ஆஜ்யா பலம் பிராப்பேத்து வை யூ ஆர் டெல்லிங் ஹீ ஓன்லி கிரியேட்டட் இஸ் விதாத்தா கர்மனாம் தத் பலானாம் ச கர்த்தா அண்ட் ஹீ நோஸ் வென் டு கிவ் ஹவு மச் டு கிவ் வாட் கிவ் தேர் ஃபார் கர்ம இஸ் நாட் பரம் கர்ம இஸ் நாட் சூப்ரீம் சுப்ரீம் லாட் இஸ் சுப்ரீம் ஆர் யூ கெட்டிங் த பாயிண்ட் ஓகே in bhagavad gita you come to bhagavad gita the practical book of philosophy karmanya vadigaraste ma parishu kadachana this line we studied so far this line only <laughs> arjuna you have all the right to do karma da parishu ma kadachana you do not have any right on phala why in phala i have right in action you have right that's all are you getting it so our bhagavad gita never says you do not expect anything you expect but you get what you want you will not get what you want you will get what you deserve that's all that is decided by me only arjuna me only why i am the lord of the universe da are you getting the point now therefore when we understand this bhagavad gita very clearly you do only action don't expect we expect that should be there but the demand should not be there if i do some action there will be some uh, reaction expect we do not at what time it will come who decides ishwara what time it will come nobody knows so there should be some ishwara to decide the time when it should come are you getting it in what way should come therefore kartu agnyaya prapite palam finished the topic is over now I hope you understood the point. Kartu Agnaya Prapite Palam Karma Kimparam Karma Tajjada. Therefore, don't uh, dwell or uh, merge so much in the karma. Karma is a tool that's all. So this is what the first shloka says. So we studied very thoroughly the first shloka. Okay? Then we have to go to the second shloka. Tomorrow only we are going to do. For five days, five shlokas only, yeah? we will see but it needs more reflection okay so we are connecting bhagavad gita also connecting bhagavad gita brahma sutra all the things together the kind of reflection study okay so we'll stop here tomorrow we'll take up the one hour class no very soon so quickly okay so we'll stop here i will have some question answer if you have then i'll we'll continue tomorrow one hour class na le am i right yes right one so i'll we'll do shanti part and then we'll spend some time okay om purnamadah purnamidam purnat purnamudachyate purnasya purnamadaya purnameva avashishyate om shanti 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 हरि ओम श्री गुरुभ्यो नम हरि ओम